The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good Friday morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Friday morning. We got 30 minutes to go until the start of trading coming into the long Labor Day weekend. And we're going to have a little bit of volatility to kick things off. Right now, you're looking at an S&P positive by three points, trading at 4539, quite a jobs number. Let's jump over to the headline number this morning. You're talking about 235,000 jobs added. The estimate was for about 735,000 jobs, quite a miss. You take a look on the chart in terms of where we were, and they revised up upward the July number to the tune of about 110,000 jobs of a revision to upward territory, pushing that number over a million, 1.05 million for the month of July. But you can see how as this virus rages on, uh, the Delta variant hits things, hospitalizations, deaths unfortunately rising, putting a hurt in the rebound of the economy with only 235,000 jobs added. You average the three months, you're still pushing about seven to 750,000 jobs. All the speculation now goes to where we go for the Fed. Fed meeting next, September 21st, 22nd. You see the initial pop in terms of the reaction on the tenure. You had a lower yield initially. You had the tenure spike all the way to 133.28. Just like that, we give back 18 ticks. That's a mammoth move. Right now, you're negative by about six ticks. On the 10-year right now, you're negative by 26 ticks. On the 30-year, jumping back to the indices to see the type of volatility we had in the S&P, you spiked to 45.49, down to 45.28, almost back to where we came into that number. NASDAQ 100, some serious volatility, up to almost 15,680, down about 100 points from there. And again, within about six to seven points of where we closed out the action yesterday. Commodities with some action on that number. Crude, back above $70, 70.41. Gold catching a bid up $17. Gold liking that number up to $18.32 initially. These are five minute bars we're looking at. Gold's up to $18.28, up by about $17 on the session. Silver's up 50 cents, $24.42. And we'll jump to the volatility index this morning. The VIX on Friday, $16.17. Pretty tame action in the VIX with some market volatility to kick off Friday trading. Interesting, we get a big economic data point as we come into the long Labor Day weekend. We're going to have live programming all day, folks, at TFNN. Go until 4 p.m. Eastern time. See what happens towards the end of the day. We may see some light volume. Uh, you may have some traders out there making a run for whether it's Cape Cod, Long Island, the Hamptons, beautiful Falmouth, Massachusetts, uh, wherever you're heading this weekend. Be safe out there, folks. No drinking and driving. Take an Uber. It's too easy these days. Take an Uber. Too easy these days uh, when you're just having too much fun with life. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be coming right back from the morning market kickoff. Be right back.